UOG Professor of Public Administration Dr. Ron McNinch has released the results of a weekend poll conducted by his students. The poll shows the Democrats gaining a supermajority with a 10-5 split. The top five are Frank Ogan Jr. with 145 people saying they think he will win, followed by Senator Tom Atta with 135. Senator Tina Munya Barnes also with 135, Speaker Judy Wampat with 134, and Senator Dennis Rodriguez Jr. with 132. Republican incumbent Chris Duenas came in at number 15, but he's tied with incumbent Dr. Erlene Yamashita with 93. Republican incumbent Sam Abini ranked at number 20, with 78 people saying they thought she would get elected. So what this poll showed is the incumbents have a big advantage. There are, there are 10 virtual incumbents on the Democrat side, five virtual incumbents on the, on the Republican side, and, and that's kind of what's favored in this kind of poll. The poll was conducted by UOG students who either showed a list or named the list of candidates to 180 people who then indicated who they thought would win. In general, there's a lot of new names, and sometimes when people are new names, they don't show up as well in this kind of format. But also new names quite often don't show up as well in the general election also. Dr. McNinch says that every three days there can be changes. There are seven three-day cycles remaining before the general election, which means the rankings can change up to seven times before the actual election. The poll is what McNinch refers to as a weekend talk poll. I believe there's three things going on. People love to get together at fiestas. They feel confident talking to their friends and family. They'll, they'll say things to their friends and family that they won't say to in general public. Also, maybe a little alcohol is going on where people are drinking a little bit and changing each other's opinions. And also, uh, the, the weekends are a time of reflection for people where people change their opinions and, and reflect on things.